Bum 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 bum. Tomatoes. Hello, welcome to the video for what is get squared distance to. Let's go ahead and write our quick little example here. I have a distance to and a square distance to node. I'll choose get distance. It's going to fire off a line trace, and we're going to go using the node and determine the distance from my starting point to the origin point or the actor's root of this wall, which is this distance, and then this is the square distance. Let's look at the node and explain a little bit more, but basically the squared distance is just the distance times itself. Simple as that. We type in squared distance. We're not going to be able to find it. It is context sensitive. It is an actor node found under utilities transformation. So we're going to need an actor for the target, which is technically the origin of where we want to start at. And then other actor is where we're going to end at. The output is a float value in unreal units. So for my example, I am starting at, let's find here, let's increase this to 20, my timeout. Let's go ahead and run this again. We're going to go ahead and start and hit get distance. And our distance is 455 and change units from my starting point here to my ending point, which is inside of this wall, which is the root of the wall. Now the square distance is that number, and I can easily show you that. We can go 455.928 times itself, and we get 207, 870, and change, which is a number here. Keep in mind, due to precision errors, that's why it's not exact, because I don't have all the precision here, but it's gonna be correct inside of the program. And that's it, that's what get square distance does. Obviously, if I'm closer, it's going to give me different numbers, and farther away will give me more. So if you need the square result of a distance, you can use the helper function, get square distance to. We're going to go to wrap this up. Remember, it uses a target of an actor for the starting and end point. Because it's an actor, it's going to use the root or the origin. So in this case, for this wall, it's going to be the inside part there. If it was my player, for example, it's going to hit the capsule component as it's the root, and it's going to be the middle part. The output's going to be a float value, which is the distance in Unreal Units. 